Hi there, it's Lita Lums Apotheca, and today we're going to make a liposomal vitamin C. Yay, out of uh, a sorbyl palmitate and soy lecithin. Um, and we're going to we're going to make it a little differently than I've made another vi a different video where I was combining uh, turmeric. I was combining turmeric as well as vitamin C, um, encapsulating them in a liposomal baggie so that it's more absorbed into your system. Let me explain. So we're gonna make it a little differently today. We're gonna keep it in the jar rather than just put it straight into our uh, ultrasonic jewelry cleaner here because it's metal. Somebody pointed out that actually there's a better way and I haven't tried it. I'm gonna try it here right now with you um, because metal, you don't want metal in your system necessarily. Um, so the whole thing, vitamin C, we all know is amazing for so many reasons. And it's so hard to get it in your body, to absorb very much of it when you're just eating it. Um, you know, when you're taking supplements orally, it's hard to bypass your digestive system. So vitamin C is a great DNA protector from free radicals. Uh, so it's a great anti-ager as well as great for many diseases. There's a, a lot more research happening with like vitamin C um, for cancer and amazing stuff. It's going to help whatever, you know, protocol you're doing already for your cancer as well as it helps manufacture collagen in your body in your, for your face and uh, as well as for all of your tissues. It's amazing for all of your tissues, your bones, your teeth your connective tissue, your muscles, everything, as well as fighting off virus, viral viruses, microbes, bacterial infections. It's great for your immune system. So, yeah, so I'm using a sorbyl palmitate, a sorbyl palmitate, which is an esterified, it's vitamin C ester, so it's esterified, so it's, it's a fatty acid. Therefore, it'll be more absorbable or dissolvable in our soy lecithin. So this is about two cups of, I put two tablespoons of this sunflower lecithin. There's a lot of soy-based liposomal vitamin Cs, which I don't know if I'm a big fan of soy. And uh, so I'm using sunflower lecithin. This one's from Blue Mountain Organics. Love raw foods. See? Both these products are amazing. Bulk supplements, I'm a big fan. Um, yeah, let's do it. So I've dissolved two tablespoons of this into my two cups of this a while ago. And it's been sitting in the fridge. I've meant to this video a while ago. So this is very dissolved. And because it's already two cups of this and the recipe says to put one cup, two tablespoons of the soy lecithin and one tablespoon of as ascorbic acid which is the water soluble one into another cup. Um, and then you can buy them in the uh, ultrasonic. But instead, I'm just gonna put one heaping tablespoon of this assorbyl palmitate, which is an ester, fat soluble into my two cups of soy lecithin <laughs> um, dissolved already. And rather than having it touch the metal, with, which is inside of this, um, it's stainless steel. And I don't know if it's absorbing these metals and encapsulating them, um, and then I'm, I'm gonna absorb them. So I'm just gonna keep it in this jar. Somebody pointed this out, that you can do this, and it will shake around. The whole thing with the ultrasonic is it's, it's vibrating at such a level that it will be um, pressuring the, oops, I hope this dissolves. Uh, it'll allow, it'll make a little, fat bubble around the vitamin C molecules. So they'll be able to bypass your digestive system, which eating, I'm just gonna shake this while I describe this. Um, right now it's just a bunch of little white flecks in there. So let's see if this is all. So in order to absorb more of the vitamin C, you can do it intravenously, which I'm not gonna go to my doctor and spend all that money doing that. So I'm gonna make, I'm gonna encapsulate the molecules in this fat bubble, so which is actually happens to be your cells are liposomes, they're like little fat bubbles. Um, so it's going to be absorbed, we'll get into the little cracks around your in your cells and be absorbed more readily. 
Okay, you can absorb up to 80, 90% of a liposome of the uh, vitamins encapsulated in liposomes than if you just eat like a heaping tablespoon of, ah, of vitamin C. You're gonna absorb about like 18%. So this is way more efficient way of doing it. All right, well, maybe I should blend this. I should, I should have blended this. <laughs> okay, we did it. I did wind up putting the solution because there's those little balls in there of the white asorbyl palmitate. I put it in my Vitamix and I blended it up. It's right back here. I didn't do that on screen because it's really loud. It's louder than this thing. And then I did, I kept it in the jar. I did it for like eight times the two minutes, six to eight. And uh, you can see, I put a little bit of water in there because it seemed like it would translate more. I don't know if it does or not. And, uh, but you can see the liquid within the jar vibrate and do its thing. So we just made some liposomal uh, sorbyl palmitate with sunflower lecithin in a jar. So we're not getting any metal. Yay. And I'm just going to cap this up, put it in the fridge or the cap and take about a tablespoon of this every morning until it's done. And then I'll make it again. So just to ensure that it's very, it's very homogenized. It's a little frothy from the blending, which arguably some people have said just blending it encapsulates it enough, but I just want to be sure. I just want to be sure. There you go. Have fun.